Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general of reading for my friends Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out together what's coming through for you. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys. And we are ready. So, your energies, guys. Uh, the Empress and the Knight of Wands. Your person's energies. Six of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Meeting of the Energies, Eight of Cups, Page of Wands. The focus is the Queen of Wands, bottom of the deck, Three of Cups. So this energy right now can go two ways, one that is past related and uh, the second one that is more uh, optimistic towards the future, allow me to say. Beautiful two of cups, bottom of the three of cups, because um, indeed the future seems to be bright. So I will keep the two of cups here with me uh, for a moment. Because basically, the feeling is uh, pretty uh, straightforward about the fact that this Knight of Wands is an energy past related for some of you, embodying the Empress energy. This can be a partner that you may have had before, inconsistent, uh, hot and cold, not reliable, allow me to say. Basically, some of you have embraced in the past the Eight of Cups energy leaving behind something that couldn't fulfill heart and soul in order to pursue ultimate emotional fulfillment. After all, this man is going for the nine and ten of cups and we see the two of cups involved in the flow. A two of cups scenario that some of you, Empress mode, can find with some of these persons. They see victory with you. The Queen of Wands that we see in the focus is about a healthy self-confidence, a balanced and high level of self-esteem that can allow a person to stand up for themselves in order to protect their energies from allow me to say, to make my point clear, player vibration, knight of wands, past related. So, an empress person able to embody the self-love ability of the empress, so a gift that we can uh, offer in our own favor. An empress person cannot uh, settle for someone that is not all in or not able to put in the required effort in order to allow a partnership to be healthy, balanced, fair and fulfilling. So basically these three of, of cups can be a third party scenario because of the Knight of Wands type of influence and some type of catalyst in favor of the decision to go all out on an adventure pursuing ultimate emotional fulfillment. Past type of energy. The future is more bright, there is love within it, which is positive. Bottom of the Two of Cups, Ace of Wands, a spark of passion, makes sense, considering the Queen and the Page of Wands. So basically, because the Empress is open and is able to recognize if an opportunity is deserving of her loving energies, in order to... Um, grant in favor of the chance a healthy growth so that um, the chance can develop in a way that can fulfill the highest potential some of you will have the opportunity to realize that some of these persons can be um, the one ideal for you six of ones so even some of them have gone through challenges along the journey, so the Eight of Cups can speak even about some of them, because this is the warrior that comes back from the battle victorious after all. There is um, 
a recognition coming from within the warrior and from the people surrounding him. The recognition is about the fact that this person will truly enjoy or some of them are already enjoying the time that can be shared with some of you guys. Three of Cups in the more uh, optimistic and positive type of vibration. We enjoy moments in uh, company of those that we care about, those that we love. The Ace of Pentacles, guys, is quite an offer. Basically, this person is willing to offer in favor of an Empress, allow me to say, uh, this brand new beginning that is super reliable, trustworthy, and extremely grounded. We can build on an Ace of Pentacles type of energy. This is a major offer, a major uh, token that can be the willingness to build up the partnership. This is the minor arcana for the sun, so happiness, fulfillment and satisfaction. We have a gateway to power through, pursuing new horizons, something completely different from the type of unsatisfying interactions that this brave man is leaving behind with the eight cups. Well thought decision, the moon in the background grants the proper depth to the evaluation. This person, again, sees victory with some of you guys. The Queen of Wands in the focus, again, is about a healthy self-confidence, a healthy self-esteem. This can be a common factor. The Empress can definitely resonate uh, with this type of vibration. It can bring it even to a higher level. But the Queen of Wands is intuitively guided. She has a black cat as a best friend, so pretty cool. And she can um, understand realize and figure out uh, what's going on around her so that she can navigate throughout the interactions and be successful according to her desires, the goals that she wants to achieve. This is a matter of love, uh, two of cups, soulmate energy, deep feelings. This can be for me the chance to grow together with a special person. And there is growth with the Empress and the Ace of Pentacles after all. The Page of Wands is the teeny tiny bit of passion, guys, completely different from the Knight of Wands. This can be the spark that ignites the connection so that the two of you can realize that there is an attraction, there is a desire to be together because you resonate with each other. There are uh, values that are in common and then feelings can be nurtured. We have the Ace of Wands involved. So a bright spark of passion, a brand new beginning that goes with the Ace of Pentacles and bottom of the Ace of Wands, the word. Completion about previous chapters going with the Eight of Cups and the uh, willingness to embrace a brand new adventure. We have a gateway again to power through, pursuing new horizons. So basically, I would like to add a little touch about the Knight of Wands in the best possible way. Granted the fact that the previous chapter is uh, left behind, so no more player interactions, allow me to say, around uh, some of you guys, the Knight of Wands can even be the desire that um, some of you are willing to um, grant in favor of a brand new partnership. Because desire can be a positive factor. It can be about the pleasure to be uh, in the company of a person that we truly like. And then feelings can grow. Absolutely. So, because otherwise the night seems to be uh, just the player type of vibration when in reality it's not. It depends on the flow of the energies. So, um, it's encouraging to be honest. This can be quite a chance and some of your persons will definitely see victory with you. Basically, some of you have already met this person and there is uh, already the chance to establish properly the partnership. Others of you will have the opportunity to encounter them and you will realize if they can be the person for you. No doubts. It's a matter of self-esteem, respect, for example. Self-love. You realize that love of self is necessary to love another. Well, 
kind of the Empress point a gift that we grant in our own favor we learn everything about it we master it and then we can share it with a special person with the Empress energy you are definitely able to do that and that's why I was saying that you will realize if the other person is the one uh, ideal for you. Patience. You are able to let the universal energy of transformation move according to its own loving rhythm. Well, a healthy growth um, requires a certain amount of time. We cannot rush things. Peacefulness. You recognize that balance kindness and love bring calmness to your soul a peaceful interaction that can develop in a healthy way that's why um, there is victory involved success triumph commitment well with the ace of pentacles most definitely you dedicate yourself to your beliefs wholeheartedly knowing that love is the essence of your very being this seems to be the description in favor of the empress by the way so this can be the chance for a commitment like the one that you were looking for and bottom of the deck we see evolution leaving behind the past that may be considered as uh, unsatisfying for the both of you whatever your stories may be but then this is a brand new chance and one that can testify the the inner growth as a process in favor of you guys you realize that obstacles are merely lessons on your path to love this is a beautiful message so guys again promising chance for those of you that can resonate um, it can be a source of a huge deal of satisfaction so if the energies uh, speak to you enjoy them guys that's it um, I truly hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful let us know if you resonate comment like share subscribe to the channel until next time I wish you the best guys take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon bye